Hey guys, I'm Colin from fruitsofspirit.com and we've got a story for you today. Today's story is called the parable of the mustard seed. Jesus told us this story and he says that the kingdom of heaven is like a mustard seed. It's one of the smallest seeds, but when planted it grows to become one of the biggest garden plants that even birds can come and perch and find shade and shelter. You know what's pretty crazy is that all of us when we were about one week old inside of our mother's belly, we are about the size of a mustard seed. After two months, we were the size of a blueberry. Four months, we were the size of an apple. And at nine months, just before we were born, we were about the size of a watermelon. You know, some of us have grown pretty big since then. But even the tallest and biggest person is still really small because we live in such a big world. Did you know that it would take about 350 days to walk around the world? That's 30 million seconds. But guess what? Even our world is really small. Our world could fit into the sun about 1 million times. But you know the craziest thing? Is our God is even bigger than the sun. In fact, our God is bigger than anything you could imagine. Now that's a pretty big God. But you know, Jesus tells this story because he wants to tell us that when we get a little bit of God into our lives, that that changes everything. Our God likes to use really small things and really small people to do really big things. He used David, who was just a small boy, to take on a giant named Goliath. He used a man named Gideon, who was the smallest of his family, to be the leader of an army. Jesus, when he was on earth, even went to eat at the house of a very tiny man named Zacchaeus, who was so small that in order to see Jesus, he had to climb into a sycamore tree. Now that's the really cool thing about God, is that no matter how small we are, and we all are very small, he still wants to use us. Please do stick around to the end of this video to find out how to receive a free coloring page of the illustration that you're seeing in this video. Also, if you've been enjoying yourself up to this point, please do consider liking this video as well as subscribing to our channel for more content like this. Did you know that one of the biggest things that we can ever do in our life is tell other people about Jesus? When I was in second grade, I was really small and didn't know very much. But one day I shared with my friend about Jesus. And after a few days, my friend came back to me and said that they wanted to have a relationship with Jesus. They wanted to accept him into their heart, and I got to pray with them. You know, this is something that we can all do. We can share with our friends and tell about how much Jesus means to us. God likes to use small people to do big things, and he has an amazing plan for each of us. Did you know that he wants to use you to do something amazing in your life? But how do we do that? Well, Jesus promises us that he'll be with us always. But Jesus isn't here anymore, so how is that true? Well, he tells us that he's given us something called the Holy Spirit, which is God that lives with us. And when we accept God into our hearts and into our lives, the Holy Spirit comes to help us and help us to make the right choices, but also to help us to do amazing, big things for God. So if you want to do big things for God today, then you can just tell God, I want you to come to live in my heart. I want you to be with me, always. Thanks for sticking around with us through this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed the parable of the mustard seed. So as promised, we've got a free coloring page available on our website, www.fruitsofspirit.com. So if you'd like to access that, once again, that's www.fruitsofspirit.com. We'll hope to see you there.